This is Jeffrey St. Laurent with the Selling Coaching Minute for coaches wanting to transition to a full-time business. Last night as I was driving to pick up my son from basketball practice, I had this huge craving for french fries. I don't know where it came from, but I certainly didn't deny myself. But I didn't have a lot of time between now and when I need to pick him up. As I hit the next stoplight, I looked up and I saw the golden arches. I can't remember the last time I had anything from McDonald's, but I was in. I got a couple large fries and waited to eat them until I picked my son up. I told him I had a surprise for him and we got in the car and it smelled amazing. You know, all the chemicals from those fries. <laughs> we turned some tunes on and we devoured those fries within minutes. In that situation, I didn't overthink the fries. I had a craving. I looked up. I saw McDonald's and I took action. I didn't second guess it. I didn't overthink it. I created a decision and I executed on it. In business, it's no different. If you're going to be successful in your coaching business, you've got to trust your gut, follow your instincts, take action and decide. If you are a coach looking to transition to a full-time business, head over to my website, sellingcoaching.com under the university for some great education to help you on your way. That's sellingcoaching.com.